Hello guys, I am Kharvi Madlani, software developer in Suflam Technologies. Today's topic is PDF Tron Overview. What is PDF Tron? PDF Tron is a leading global provider of high performance document processing technology serving thousands of customers across the broad spectrum of industries. Here are some benefits of PDF Tron. It enables users to view, edit, annotate, or sign PDF in any application or in a web browser. We can view, preview, assemble, manipulate, redact, and collaborate on Word document. It generates PDF from Word template dynamically, views CAD and BIM file without a license. It is available self-hosted or from the cloud. We can embed video in a web app and provide player control. We can add text extension to any Windows, Linux, or Mac OS application via its OCR SDK framework in which PDF Tron is supported. React, Angular, Vue, Next.js, Electron, Blazor, Servlet, Nuxt.js. We can integrate via three methods. First is integrate via NPM on client side. Second, manual integration. And third is integrate via NPM on server side. Let's start with first one, integrate via NPM on client side. So the first step will be to install the PDF Tron web viewer. To install it, you have to run this command. This will install the main JS enter point as well as download some static assets required for web viewer to run. In second step, you have to copy that static assets required to run the PDF viewer to a public location that will be served via HTTP or HTTPS. The static file are in node modules PDF Tron web viewer public folder. Here are some ways you can automate this process. You can automate via npm script, webpick, and parse it. npm script. Add a script to your packet.json that grabs the static file for you after your build is complete. So basically, you have to copy this content in your package.json file. After your build is complete, it will copy all the necessary files to the distinct public folder, second webpack. If you use Webpack to bundle your project, you can use the copy Webpack plugin to automatically copy the files for you. To install, you have to run this command on your terminal. After that, you have to add this code in your Webpack configuration, third is parcel. If you are using parcel to compile your project, you can use parcel plugin static file copy to copy your files. To install the package, you have to run this command in your terminal. And for that, you have to copy this content in your web page configuration. Second is manual integration. Let's get ready with a server environment. Install the package by running this command. Next step will be to create a folder for your project. Let's assume the folder you created is PDF Tron demo. Start the server by executing this command HTTP server dash a localhost. It will be hosted on server a lo localhost port number 8080. Then you have to extract the web viewer package to your project directory slash my server. Now create a new index.html web page in the same project directory and paste in it. So after that you have to paste this command, paste this code in your uh, index.html file and next to initiate web viewer add this script to the body after the viewer due declaration from the previous step so you have add this command for web viewer next to initiate that web viewer you have to paste the script inside due tag next integrate via npm on server side so per requirement will be 64 bit windows and Node.js version between 8 to 18. Initial startup, run this command to install npm package. 
For this, you will need PDF tone trial key. If your OS or Node.js version is not supported, the installation will fail. You will get your trial key from this link. To hand the sample, open the command line console and execute the below command. Change the directory to node modules PDF tron PDF net node sample folder to run the web viewer. You have to run npm run test command. Integrate into your project. So you you can now import the PDF tron SDK by using the following in your Node.js code. At the end of the code, don't forget to call PDF net dot shutdown. Otherwise, your Node.js program will be hanged. So thank you guys for watching. Keep following us. Feel free to contact in case of any questions. Thank you.